Now I'd like to um, go to other panel members, and uh, now we refer directly to the uh, practitioners. So I would like um, uh, Mr. Kostovic, uh, who is a reputed oncologist, to tell, uh, to tell us how, uh, how do you feel about personalized medicine in the Romanian uh, actual context, and how do you, uh, how, how, what is your feeling about the future? First of all, thank you for being here. Um, well, uh, I see personalized medicine like a madness <laughs> now in Romania. But uh, we, we, we have uh, great hopes from the National Insurance <laughs> House <laughs> because uh, I, think, uh, I think this is the future for, 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 our treat for the treatment of our patients. And I think this is the best. And um, I agree with Professor Haim Spin. Uh, I think it's, of course, better to have a package, package with tests. It's absolutely important, of course, because the Romanian people, most of them are poor, uh, and so on. These tests are costly for them. But I think if the National Insurance House made a little effort for paid this kind of test, maybe a, a part of that, uh, we can do uh, economy in the therapy, because now, in Romania, and I, I'm sure that uh, in almost um, European countries, maybe in the U.S., uh, most patients are um, over treatment, that's for sure. Um, and uh, when we have to choose between treatments, let's say uh, breast cancer uh, with indication uh, like in protocols, uh, we don't know what to do with chemotherapy, hormonotherapy, both. Uh, so on. So, when we are going to do such uh, genetic tests, we, we have a, a, a clear mind for, for sure, <laughs> and we know what's the, what's the uh, deal. So, um, um, I'm optimistic, that's for sure. Uh, I'm sure that in uh, next months or maybe years, uh, that, that we, we are going straight forward, for sure. Thank you so much.